Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Stay with us and please subscribe my channel to get update news of The Witcher show. Henry Cavill, a British actor, has played some incredibly memorable roles, such as Superman and Geralt of Rivia, but his newest film role in the Highlander reboot will surpass both his previous endeavors and his most recent failures. Cavill has had a difficult time with his career over the last year or so. James Gunn, the director of the newest Superman films for DC, surprisingly dropped Cavill from the series in favor of a brand new ensemble cast. In addition, Cavill's final season as Geralt in The Witcher just finished airing, and Liam Hemsworth will take over Cavill's role. Despite these problems, though, Henry Cavill hasn't lost too much steam in Hollywood. The next project for Henry Cavill is a reboot of the popular film and television franchise Highlander. First begun in 1986, Highlander was a fantasy film telling the story of a 16th century Scotsman, Connor MacLeod, who suffers what should be a fatal wound but survives. Seeking answers, MacLeod discovers that he is part of a race of immortal warriors, and on the horizon, an actual war is coming. 1986's Highlander jump-started an entire franchise of historical action films and series, which are now being revived as Henry Cavill and Chad Stahelski's next projects. Henry Cavill's foray into the Highlander movies is a great move considering his success with The Witcher. Despite leaving the role, Cavill clearly had a deep care for Geralt and The Witcher world, and his commitment showed in his performance. Unfortunately, though, The Witcher hasn't been the greatest example of a well-adapted fantasy series. Though The Witcher season 1 impressed critics and audiences, the consequent seasons have only gotten worse reviews. For the most part, the reason behind this is that the series lacks accuracy to its source material. Since The Witcher has continued to let down its audiences, especially with Cavill's exit, his new role as Connor MacLeod is sure to overshadow The Witcher. Highlander has the chance to avoid mistakes that The Witcher made, and in this way, be better received by audiences. Furthermore, since the Highlander reboot is movies rather than a television series, there is a chance that it has less room to make mistakes. Bound into just a couple of hours, Highlander won't fall into the chaos that The Witcher has at times become prey to. On the other hand, Henry Cavill's Highlander reboot will also be the perfect replacement for the Superman franchise. While Cavill losing out on the iconic role was certainly a disappointment for fans, his new part in Highlander is really not so different from the iconic DC superhero. Cavill will still be a leading man, and he will still have the opportunity to be a hero with incredible strength and powers. Though he won't exactly be donning a red cape, Highlander offers very similar on-screen opportunities as Superman would. The tones may be different, but the foundation is the same. Furthermore, Highlander delves deeper into what Cavill seems to really excel at fantasy. While Cavill was no doubt an outstanding Superman, he has seemed to lean further and further into fantasy. And honestly, that is where his talents lie. Cavill is superb at playing strong, rugged heroes that must face terrible monsters and battles. Plus, his commitment and attention to detail is perfect for pre-existing franchises. Overall, it feels right that Cavill's time as a superhero is ending in exchange for a franchise that is a bit more distinct and dark. In the end, Highlander is a massive achievement for Henry Cavill. The British actor has had an impressive career so far, but two major hits against him in the form of Superman and The Witcher can still strike a big loss. It wouldn't have been surprising if Cavill took a hiatus from acting in order to recuperate and change gears. Despite these setbacks, the on-screen hero hasn't stopped, and fortunately, the studios still adore him. Overall, Highlander is evidence that Henry Cavill won't be forgotten and that he still possesses the skills necessary to be a memorable leading man. Despite having lost such important parts, he won't let it stop him from pursuing major franchises and fantasy epics.
Hopefully, Cavill's Connor McLeod can help the actor get out of this slump and possibly give him a lift. The failures of Superman and The Witcher this year will undoubtedly be forgotten if Highlander is a success.